Hello YouTube, it's Colored Fish. Um, today I'm going to be taking you through my personal fishing guide. My fishing level is only 82. Now, that's not a problem because today we're just going to be fishing sharks. Now, with this fishing method, it's not the uh, the most profitable profitable fishing method, but it's my personal fishing method, and it does not require Shiloh Village. But some do this Shiloh Village quest because it it proves effective when you have to fish salmon and trout. Um, Alright, but let's start off. Okay, so I'm in Draenor because the first method that I'm going to show you guys today is uh, actually going to be shrimp and anchovies. So, in order to get to Draenor, you can either use one of these, which is a Amulet of Glory, um, or you could use many other methods. Ah, I forgot to turn my trade off. Sorry about that, guys. Alright, so now from this bank here, which you would, you would teleport out here if you used your glory, um, you'll run out here to the fishing spot. Now when you run out here to the fishing spot, you're going to be fishing shrimp to 1 to 15. Now after you fish shrimp from 1 to 15 with your small fishing net, you're going to catch anchovies from 15 to level 20. Let's give it a shot. Alright, so we're catching shrimp now. And shrimp, I believe, are 10 experience per and I believe it's around 250 catches that you have to get for this and anchovies I'm not sure the number of catches you need for that from 15 to 20 but um, yeah, I'm sure it's not too much alright so this is fishing method number one I'll come back to you guys with fishing method number two here in a second alright so you'll notice that I'm in Edgeville now um, that's because the second part of my fishing method is uh, salmon and trout fishing. So this is the bank you'll be using. But you'll go from here to Barbarian Village and make sure you have a fly fishing rod and a certain amount of feathers. Recommended is 700. Now, we're going to be using this method from 20 to 40, so you're going to want to make sure you have a sufficient amount of feathers. I always think it's better to overbuy than underbuy. Alright, so when you come into the fishing spot, you're going to select Lure, which will cast your rod. Now, I did not know there's an achievement for this, and I haven't, sh I haven't fished here for a very long time before achievements came out. That's why I just got that. Um, but... You're, you'll be getting raw salmon and raw trout and I believe that trout or salmon is 70 and as you can see in my experience counter it's 70 and salmon is 50 no trout is 50 alright now that we've got that sorted out now if you want to use this for food which is a good idea you can run over here pretty convenient cook it Alright. Now I'm not positive what the fishing or what the cooking level for salmon and trout are, but um, I'm sure it's not too much. But you can use this fire here in the helmet shop, I believe it is, here in Barbarian Village, and cook as much salmon and trout as you want. Alright, so after you get done f f cooking your your fish or whatever it is you're here for of course you're going to be cooking fish but um you'll run back to the Edgeville bank which I won't run all the way back to we will just go back in this direction the way we came and bank there in Edgeville and come back alright now method 3 is coming up I'll pause and play the video when I get to uh, my third fishing method alright so now we're in Catherby. Now, here in Catherby, there is a fishing spot over here that you can't see right now. I'll take you there in a second. But first, you're going to need, you're going, you're going to need, you have your lobster pot. You're going to run over here from the bank. 
I believe it's east you're going to run over here and find a fishing spot that says cage like this one now it's not very quick but um, and it's not extremely profitable but it's more profitable than trout and salmon and this is where you're going to actually see some sort of money coming in and you might not want to use this as food you might want to just sell this depending on your circumstances now if we can catch a lobster I can show you how much experience they gave because I don't know off the top of my head I believe it's like a hundred something along those lines Uh, it's 90 actually, it was 10 off, alright. So, this is lobsters, and you're going to be doing this from level 40 to level 62 fishing. Alright, and I'll be back with my fourth method of fishing. Alright, now you'll notice I'm at the fishing guild now, and some of you may be saying, well, wait, you can't get into the fishing guild until you have level 68 fishing, right? Well, that's true. But, if you have something called an admiral pie, you can increase your fishing by a couple of levels. Now, when you increase your fishing, however, the downside of this is after you log out and you've eaten your Admiral Pie, Admiral Pie and been granted access through this gate, you will be kicked out. Depending on how long you play in certain periods of time, like five or six, um, until you can actually achieve 68 fishing. Alright, so right now my fishing level is 82. We'll see how much the Admiral Pie raises. Alright, so from, from 82 I eat my Admiral Pie and it increases my level to 87. So that's 5 levels. Now, you can't get access into the fishing guild from 62 to if you even eat an Admiral Pie. You have to achieve one more level at least. But, let's get on with it. And if you've been wondering what these uh, little potions in my inventory are, they're just energy potions, nothing to worry about. Alright, now, the third, or the fourth method, sorry, of my fishing, my personal, fi my personal fishing method, is to use either a barbed tail harpoon or a regular harpoon and fish swordfish. Now, you're going to fish swordfish from level uh, 62 to level 90. Um but you do have to be dedicated um, <clears throat> but the point is you're gonna have to it's gonna take a lot of work um, until you can actually achieve uh, 99 fishing and I know a couple of friends who have done it and I'm on my way to doing it personally right now but um <clears throat> first I'll be getting 99 wood cutting but that's off topic alright so after you achieve 90 fishing okay, so although I'm not uh, at sufficient level and I'm being a little bit of a hypocrite right now um, <laughs> you can uh, fish sharks at level 76 but uh, it's really not worth it until you achieve level 90 fishing now some of you may be saying well why do you want to go and fish swordfish to 90 when there's perfectly good monkfish to fish well that may be true but it also requires swan song um, which requires a number of uh, certain combat skills and other quests. So, uh, for right now, this is this is my method because I do have not done Swan Song yet. Um, mostly because I was just a skiller not too long ago, um, and I'm sure most of you can understand that. This is a pretty skiller-friendly guide, if you ask me. Um, but yeah, so you'll be fishing these little guys to level 90, and. Um, that's about it. I'm I'm glad you guys enjoyed my video. Please comment, rate, subscribe, and follow my channel. I'll talk to you guys some other time on another guide, maybe a vlog. Alright, um, please leave suggestions in the comment box or on my channel. I appreciate your, uh, your uh, participation in my videos. Um, Alright, well I guess that's all for today. Bye guys.